Welcome to this week's Feature Friday video. Today we're going to learn how to assemble the Dynamics rosette. I'm working with the quarter inch rosette today. The die looks like this. There's also the 3 8 inch rosette. The technique is the same, but you end up with different sized blooms. So for today we're just going to use the quarter inch rosette, and I've cut it twice to make the full size rosette. You can find the common die cutting stacks at www.mftstamps.com. You'll see that it's cut out the rectangle and made many score lines. Now I'm going to fan fold it. Remember when you're in kindergarten and you do this by hand? This is a lot easier when you just follow the pre-scored lines back and forth and it creates a little fan. I'm going to go ahead and do that with the other strip and save you the time of having to watch it. Now that I have both fan folded, I've placed a line of adhesive and I'm going to nestle the two together into one continuous strip. Now I'll place a line of adhesive just on the end and join the two ends together into a continuous circle. I like to use Jody boosters, but any strong circular adhesive will work. I flip the rosette over, gather the center, and place the strong adhesive on the back. Now we can try making it in a mini size. We're going to use the same die cut, cut the paper again, and this time I'm going to cut it in half. I'm going to repeat the same process, fan folding back and forth, and I'll save you the process of having to watch this. You know now, you know now what I'm talking about. So we're going to fan fold it back and forth on both pieces and adhere the two tiny fan folded pieces together, same as the last sample. Now I'll put adhesive on the end, gather it into a circle, put it face down on the table, and secure with a strong glue dot. Here you can see the size of the mini rosette and the original rosette. Thanks so much for visiting with us today. Please join us at mftstamps.com.